Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. And today we're learning about product of conjugates pattern. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help, you use Minute Math. We have this pattern here with these conjugates. They are basically this a minus b times an a plus b is equal to an a squared minus b squared. You can think of the conjugate more like a complement, right? a minus b complements a plus b. So how do we apply this to our real world problems? Well, not really real world, but the problems you'll encounter in class. First one's here. 2x plus 5 times a 2x minus 5. We want to identify specifically our a's and b's that work for this pattern. So we look at this, our first value, we have if the 2x is equal to a, which we might have here, so if a is equal to 2x, what would my b equal? Well, the b value, do we have an a minus a b, which we have right here, a minus a b. We have an a plus a b right here, if b is just a 5. Just a 5. Be careful. A lot of times people try and put a minus sign in there. It's the value right there, just the 5. Since we have that pattern set out, we can rewrite it as such, a squared minus a b squared. So a being a 2x, we have a 2x all squared, the whole thing, minus our b value, which is 5, all squared. And from there, we need to simplify. 2x all squared, 2 squared is a 4 and x squared is an x squared, minus 5 squared, a 25. So using our product of conjugates pattern, we get a 4x squared minus a 25. Let's try another example here. We have 5m minus 9n times 5m plus 9n. What are our a's and b's here? If 5m is our a, then we have a minus our 9n, which is our b, and plus a 9n, which is the b there. So let's go label it out. a is equal to 5m, and b is just equal to the 9n, 9n right there. So we need to rewrite this in this form. Again, 9n is positive. So a squared, 5m all squared, minus our b squared, 9n all squared. All right, now let's simplify. 5 squared is a 25. m squared is an m squared. From there, subtract it here, 9n all squared. 9 times 9 is an 81. n squared is an n squared. And there we have it. Using our product of conjugates pattern, we got an answer of 25m squared minus an 81n squared. I hope you learned something here on the product of conjugates pattern. If you did, make sure you like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. This helps us make more of these free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching.